Good afternoon, I'm here with uh, Sheridan, and Sheridan's director of the vol Volunteers Program. And uh, tell us a little bit about the Volunteers Program. When did it start? Gosh, our volunteer program started like in 1975. They're 43 years old. And it was primarily physician wives. I'm not sure how many they started with. I think they wanted to be closer to what was going on with their husband's lives. So they started with a gift shop on a cart. Fast forward to 2018, mm -hmm. and how many volunteers do you have now? We have 135 and always wanting more. You have volunteers spread out throughout the whole Shannon facilities. We, we have, um, you guys basically staff about 12 Locations? 12, 12 services, morning and afternoon for most services. Some are just morning. What do you love about working with the volunteers? Because they are special, uh, they, they are so special to us here at Shannon. They have just such good hearts. They're just servants and that's what we need. They're here to make somebody else's day a little bit better. So they just kind of become part of your family and they treat you that way and they just, they're just a loving group. So it makes my, my job really easy. I want to really appreciate what the volunteers do. We couldn't do what we do here at Shannon without all their support and their help. Um, they're much appreciated. Let's go meet some of our volunteers. Let's do it. What do you like the best about um, volunteering here at Shannon? What I like the best? I like the people. And I don't mean just the people that come in the front door. I just love the people in the hospital. Well, I, I thought you were going to say CEO, but the I was, people are the next. I was, the people I was are getting, the best, next best thing. I was getting to that uh, next. <laughs> Y'all been here a long time, like Ooh, you said, 14 time. years, 10 years, Eight five years. years. Well, we appreciate we all your it. years of service, and uh, we thank, thank you for all you thank did. You. We thank you for letting us volunteer. Yes. No, yeah. I appreciate you guys. Yeah, I thank appreciate you. you too. 135 in all, and it's like an extended family. Yes, it's like family. We have 135. I'm actually here with uh, Dot and Bonnie, and Dot is actually been, how many years have uh, you been here doing volunteer services? 16 years. 16 years? What do you love about volunteering, volunteering your time here at Shannon? What do you love the best about it? It's the greatest blessing in my life right now. With the camaraderie, with the staff, with everybody in the hospital, it has just been wonderful. And I know Bonnie, you, you actually been a volunteer for just a little over a year now, right? About a year, mm -hmm. about a year. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, these people coming into the surgery waiting room there, um, they seem to have a lot on their minds. Yeah. And so they just need a, a hand sometimes. They're scared of what might be, or what might not be, or they're just a lot of anticipation. And so mm -hmm. I, I love this area. Well, Y'all do an amazing job. Y'all are part of our Shannon family, and I don't know what we'd do without you guys. So you've been driving them for how long? Probably be almost two years. Two years? Two yes. Years? I know um, one of the things that we had going on here at Shannon is we were having parking issues because um, just getting so busy, a lot of growth, a lot of new doctors, and a lot of new services, and, and uh, thanks to the volunteers, this is one of the areas that y'all funded this beautiful um, vehicle, and you guys staff it actually on your own yes. time and volunteer uh, from a volunteer standpoint. How many people do you pick up in a normal day, would you say? On average, about 20, 20 to 25. When you pick people up, they visit with you quite a bit? Or? Oh, you bet, you bet. <laughs> I had one man ask me one time if I'd take him all the way to Brady, because he was joking. <laughs> and I said, well, only if it's downhill. What do you do during like uh, incremental weather? What if it's raining or anything? We have uh, some flaps here on the side that okay. roll down and uh, connect at the bottom. And it's enclosed that way. I know at times um, we might have patients uh, actually show up at a building and they're in the wrong building and they're looking for their doctor or looking for their loved one and uh, how does how do they get a hold of you to come pick them up if that happens? Whichever building they're in the receptionist uh, has the phone number for the cell phone that we have here in the shuttle and uh, they can call us and tell okay. us where they are and where they need to go. Well I'm here with Francis and we're actually in the gift shop in how many gift shops do we have here at Shannon? We've got two, one here at the main hospital and one at the women and children's. The great thing about the gift shops is a lot of the proceeds from the gift shop go to help Shannon in, in, in paying for things that we can nom normally buy for special equipment. A lot of people come through here, you know, and it's just, I just love to, you know, to see the people in here. They're just always looking for somebody to listen to them or just to visit and of course, you know, buying stuff for their loved ones. I came about six months ago and I just love it. I love the people. I just, you know, enjoy helping people pick out gifts for their loved ones. So um, it's, it's really nice. When I first learned about this, my husband was here for a procedure 
and I got sent to the ICU waiting room to wait for him to be done with his procedure. And some lady in there at the ICU waiting room, one of the volunteers, uh, she would come up to me and she was so sweet, you know, and she mm -hmm. just touched my heart, you know. And I said, how can I do this? I want to do this too. I want to touch people's hearts, you know. So she said, I'll get you an application. <laughs> and it was on from there, you know, and I've loved ever since. This is just a small sampling of the many volunteers that we have throughout Shannon. I think it was mentioned earlier, we have 135 volunteers. They do an amazing job for us here at Shannon as well as our, our, our visitors and family members that come with, um, with our patients. Um, we so appreciate all they do. Thank you so much.